Mic check, mic check, mic check. Can you hear me? Can y'all hear me out there? What's good, folks? I've done a couple of videos where I talked about audio. Now, some of you know, may, maybe not all of you, that I am a recording artist with the group Crew 54. We've been recording ourselves for years. I'm talking about a variety of microphones. So if you care anything about like home studio stuff, setting up microphones, you definitely want to check this video out that I just put out on a complete studio bundle in a box. Now, a couple of months back, I did a video about the Rode Video Mic Studio Bundle Kit. You can check that out as well. I will leave a link down below. Basically, it's a whole kit where you get a microphone, a stand, all of that to plug right into your camera to help you get better quality audio for your videos, whether it's on YouTube, whether you're just trying to get audio on set, there are a lot of different options. But one of the options that a lot of people, especially content creators, go back to is something like this. This is a lavalier microphone. This is the Pop Voice. They sent this over for me to check out the PV510. We're gonna check this out, see if it's any good, see if you got any good audio coming out of it. Definitely wanna give a big shot out to the folks over at Pop Voice for sending this over. Like I said, I'm gonna leave links down below. I wanna say this is $14. Let's see if I can figure out. Oh, it's even cheaper than that. This is 13 bucks. So if it's any good for you to be able to get quality at that price, always something to consider, at least keeping this in your bag. I don't know what that shaking is, we're gonna find out. Let's open it up. Right out of the box, you get your nice little bag with Pop Voice. Now, I always say how I never use these bags, but with lavalier microphones, I actually do because I'll keep these in my camera bags. Now when you're out on set, now if you gotta mic up an interview or whatever, you have a couple of different options ready to go. Let's pop this open. This is a, is it, is it velvet? What is that, velvet? Got a little baggie here with some tips, some phone tips to go on the actual microphone itself. I believe this adapter is so that you can plug it right into your camera because the one that's on there will work if you plug it into like iPhones and stuff like that. So this is adapter, we gotta keep this because I'm gonna plug this right into my camera and see what kind of sound we get. You get a little booklet, it says, we do best microphones, care details, care your voice. <laughs> I love the uh, translations, but I was correct. It does say here, this is the PC adapter. So that was the adapter that you use if you wanna plug it into your camera, plug it into your PC or anything like that. Like maybe you're doing a Skype call and you wanna just plug that in, that's an option to use. Here we have the actual microphone. Wow, I gotta say, it doesn't look terrible quality for $12. I've had some that were this cheap. They just felt super flimsy and really like it was just gonna fall apart. You got here a nice little cable tie. You know, nothing special, it's just a cable tie, but the fact that you have it is good. The cable could be thicker, but it's not too bad. And then you got a nice long cable. The one that I have is 16 feet, which is pretty long. Yeah, this is a lot of cable. This is a lot of cable. You got your, what is it? TRRS tip right here. So this is the one that you can plug right into your phone. And then we have the adapter here, which is the TS or I'll put it up top if I'm getting it wrong. Slide that on there. Now here you got a nice heavy duty clip. Wow, that's a heavy duty clip. I can't even get it open. Ah, okay, yeah, you got a nice heavy duty clip. So with no further ado, I'm going to switch from my Rode video mic camera here and I'm gonna switch to this and we're gonna test the audio and see what's good. All right, folks, as you can see, I now have the lavalier mic connected to my chest. And like I said, you have 16 Feet. So you'll be able to run this under your clothes, run it along the floor, maybe get some gaffing tape, run it along the floor or along a pole, however you want to have your setup. But if you're doing in the room, content creating, interviews, things like that, this is definitely a pretty good option. But I want you guys to let me know what it sounds like down below in the comments. Is it worth $12? Does it sound like it should be worth more? Do you think this is good quality audio for you to get 
on a budget. I'm gonna get up out of here. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. It's your Ken Folk Dookie. Holla at your boy. And yes, this is like the third video I did with this exact shirt on in a row. I don't wanna hear it. We know what it is. I gotta get these done. That's all that matters. Let's go.